When you're cooking up a protest, <laughs> Meals on Wheels drivers may be dignified, <laughs> but they mean business. We get 100% on our state inspections, and we send out food that is really good. Susan Hannawalt is the director of this godsend, where the phone rings even when the burners are off. Somebody wants it for extra space and they're willing to ruin what might be a two million dollar kitchen. It's a kitchen that serves 50,000 Meals on Wheels every year to Peters Township's aged and infirm. The food is great quality and we get great appreciation from our seniors. So the thought of having to give up that kitchen and move somewhere is just overwhelming. Turns out the Peters Fire Department wants the building for storage and office space. And neither Meals on Wheels $4,000 monthly rent check nor this packed council meeting tonight may change that. So now this kitchen, kitchen and its hundreds of volunteers may have to close up shop. There must be something better than this. It's a shame. The bread and butter, though, of tonight's council meeting, Director Susan Hannawalt and her plea, listen to it carefully. Old timers have told me that we have no chance of changing your minds because council does whatever the fire department wants. I'm asking you to reconsider your decision to kick us out of this space. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah, that applause went on for like 30 seconds. Meals on Wheels volunteers, they are praying for a miracle tonight. The township has not renewed their lease, and so all the upgrades made to their kitchen to serve so many senior citizens, it'll all be turned over to the Peters Township Fire Department.